welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Foxy New. Ryan Garcia and Tank Davis will not happen in 2022. And look, let's break it down honestly and objectively as possible. And according to Oscar De La Hoya, they are moving on from the Dravanta Tank Davis fight. When asked why are they moving on, he said he's had zero contact. We're trying to get a hold of Tank's side. We don't know who to talk to. Nobody picks up their phone. Nobody calls back. I feel like they're playing games. So I'm moving on and I'm going to Tiafimo's fight. End quote. That's Oscar De La Hoya. They're moving on from the Dravanta Tank Davis fight, but it was obviously clear the whole time this fight was never going to get made, especially this year. Any moron can see the writing on the wall. You've seen Golden Boy State many times. The zone has to be involved in any Tank Davis and Ryan Garcia fight. You've seen Steven Espinosa for Showtime State that they are not inclined to work with the zone for any Ryan Garcia Tank Davis fight. So what the hell were they even talking about like this fight was ever going to happen? I predicted this a long time ago ago now you have oscar de la hoya saying that they're going to scout tiafimo next potentially for ryan garcia that fight's not happening either these guys are clout chasing let's just be honest and unbiased about it we understand tiafimo's not going back to the zone he's already stated that and you've already seen bob arum made it abundantly clear that he has no interest in putting his fighters on the zone so while you're mentioning Tank Davis, while you're mentioning Teofimo Lopez, we understand that you've actually called up Maxi Hughes and made an offer to him. Stop the cap. Because men lie, women lie, but the facts don't lie.